Hello friends, welcome to Unity 3D Teacher Tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to change a skybox material to the script. So let's see how to do that. So generally what we'll do, in order to add a skybox, we'll go to render and we'll go to the right settings and we can change the skybox whatever we like. So that is a concept by default we'll do. So in order to change the script, in order to change the skybox during the time of uh, gameplay, someone is playing that game they like to change a skybox uh, sunny or uh, winter kind of system you want to give it to the user choice so that they can change whatever they like so at this kind of scenario so you want to make uh, some run, run time tweaking between the skybox material so let's see how to do that in the script so let's create a script so let me close this Skybox controller. Okay. So the Skybox controller is going to control the script, right? So where we want to control? So it should be main. Yeah. Okay. So let's create a material. Public material. Map. Map. So drag and drop the material. So this is the material is going to change at the runtime. So I am just picking this first one. This is uh, similar like blue color. It changed from orange to blue. So, so in order to change, you want to have render setting. To access a light, in order to access a lighting system, you want to get render settings and then skybox. So within that light system, you want to get skybox. And then you want to assign the material. So that's it. So once the script has been loaded, so it will start uh, loading the skybox at the time. Okay. So let's see it's working or not. So hit play. So that's it. So in this way, you can be able to change a multiple skybox, which allows the user uh, changing the skybox in the form of uh, giving your options like in the button or from image or something. So we try to add a button so to button so so I'm going to make Just call the new button. So it has been present in new camera. Skybox controller and change sky. If you are trying to call a change sky function with the focus button, so it will trigger here and skybox will change. So hit play. So it won't do anything. So whenever the user click on change, it will change. So in this way you can able to change the skybox at runtime. So that's it. If you think this video is very helpful for you, please subscribe us for more video more video like this. Thank you.